all important very first day at school. Children who know beforehand, in advance, what to expect from school are likely to cope very much better from the start, from day one. So it is best to prepare right from the start. So what can you do? First thing, visit the school in advance. There are things to think about like the journey, how are you going to get there. Some schools may be nearby and you may have passed the school every day but others may be a little bit further away. Either way it's good to make sure you're familiar with the actual school. Even better to go inside to arrange a visit to meet the child's teachers, the children, other children, and to get to know a little bit the geography of the inside of the school, where the, the loos are, where they're going to have their break, the playground, where they're going to eat, all those little things that can cause anxiety in children, if they can see and think about how those things are going to be, it will make them feel more relaxed about the very first day. Meeting other children is a great way of getting to feel more relaxed in the school and especially if the teachers will give out class lists of future children that will be in your child's class because that way you can arrange to have play dates before school ever starts so that there is somebody that they can be friendly with and have the opportunity to talk about school well in advance. You can also as a parent talk with your child about what to expect. Things about the school day, about routines, about learning, about playing as well of course. It's not all going to be just hard work and an effort. They must have things to look forward to in school. It, to see it as a great opportunity, a great place for fun and for meeting people and for enjoying themselves. Children need to have been able to separate from you, the parents, in order to be left at school. And if you've been with your child a lot and your child hasn't had much opportunity, that might be a little bit harder. So try and practice that well in advance too. Just little by little, leaving your child perhaps with another child, if uh, a neighbour's a child or a uh, family friend, whoever you can find and know about, and the more different sorts of people the better, and leaving them to play independently for very short periods at a time, gradually increasing these. Of course, for any preschooler you can't just go away and entirely and leave them, that, that they could get into a lot of uh, danger and mischief. You have to be there, but without them really seeing you, that you are there. And if they are playing with another a child and they get into a scrap with each other and start fighting, it's really better if after a short period of time, if they haven't resolved that difficulty, you step in to help them so that they learn how to resolve conflicts uh, with other children and so that the other child goes away thinking well of your child because um, you don't want another child saying oh this child your child isn't very nice and you're not friends they're not friends with your child bringing that into the new classroom so make sure that any child that comes to play with your child goes away having had a great time and happy so be on hand to step in should the situation arise and with young children that commonly is the case so practice those short separations finally and perhaps most important of all is don't be over anxious yourself this if you are and um, you may well be because it is you don't know what to expect your child doesn't know what to expect don't let your child see your worries and anxieties because they will very quickly pick up on those and start to be anxious themselves. They'll start to think, well, there really must be something to worry about in school if mum's worried or dad's worried. And even if you haven't said that, they will feel it. So take well care to be as relaxed and calm and transmit the idea that it's going to be a really pleasant place to be. And if there are any issues that they don't know about or worried about, that something can be done 
to help sort it all out. And that's what it's about, sorting th things out, just not worrying unnecessarily about them.